Hello, hello, and welcome to my YouTube channel, Volvo Christian, and welcome to a luggage test, EX30 versus XC40, and soon to be EX40. But we're not here to talk about naming strategy. We're here to talk about luggage capacity. EX30 versus XC40 regarding these suitcases here. I'm here recording at Volvo Car Store Oslo at Ökan. Huge thanks to them, and huge thanks to the salesman, Thomas, for providing me the opportunity to make this video for you, and also for giving me the opportunity to steal this crystal white out of the showroom floor. So I have to be quick in this video. I've already made a couple of videos starring these suitcases. This is a set from Samsonite. We have two large cases. I will put a box on one of the sides with the sizing of these. We have two large. We were supposed to have two medium, but one of them got lost. We have two small and we have one little handbag thing. All Samsonite cases, hard cases. I made a couple of videos, as I said before. Um, a couple of years ago, I have to remember to make a playlist on my YouTube channel uh, today. But I made a video with the XC40, XC60, V60 and V90 cross country. Um, and in my XC40 video, I had two of these large ones in the bottom. I can overlay a picture afterwards, um, so I don't have to move the camera. I had two of these large in the bottom. And remember, if you're doing this yourself and you're going on a longer journey, Remember safety. Put up the safety net that Volvo includes on the XC40, or maybe get the steel grid. I have had a steel grid in many of my Volvos. Super nice, you just have it up, up in the roof and just fold it down. So I will go for the steel, roof my, uh, steel grid myself. In the video I made uh, a couple of years ago, I had two of these medium on top, and I also had a soft bag uh, on top. You see, so much space available. Since I don't have the medium bag, I'm using the too small here. You can see, no problem fitting every one of these inside the XC40. There's so much space available. And with the XC40, you can also fit a roof box. Maybe a ski guard roof box, 830 Touring, with a low and sleek look. You can have additional luggage. So, as you see, so much space available. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. <laughs> I have to overlay a picture up with my phone. Uh, let's see, 16, 9, 16. You can see here. I'm just going to do this. I have to do it fairly rapid, so I'm sorry about that. But the car needs to go back in the showroom floor. There's so much people here today. Um, you're just pouring in. Four of the EX30 uh, cars were going out. Uh, and the one they had here, um, like a, I don't, yeah, probably a demo car that as well, that was also uh, a drop-in. We wanted to uh, test the EX30 instantly, so yeah. Then we stole the showroom car. But now it's time for the EX30. How will that manage these cases? Uh, yesterday, when I uh, was quickly by uh, here, uh, my sales rep Thomas here at uh, Ökan, he, had, he showed me the solution to get these in, because he, ha he has tested it a couple of times. I have just uh, lowered this uh, flooring here. I can overlay a picture of that as well, because you can have the floor in two different levels. And you see the floor now, here is in the normal height, and then I have pushed it one step down. We're starting with a large case. This isn't big enough to go this way, because then the trunk door won't open. Or close. So we have to put it sideways. You can even put it standing or laying down. Uh, Thomas showed me yesterday that he has them standing. So I will try that solution now. So one of them standing. We're going to do the medium case. Also standing sideways. Just get the wheels. And as I said earlier with the XC40, safety. Sadly, the EX30 doesn't have a net available, and there's no holes here. The opening from the roof line and over to the top of the backrest, they aren't so major that I think it's going to be a problem. But if I was supposed to do this myself, I wouldn't put a hard case with something heavy on top. Maybe just a soft bag and just tie it down with some, uh, down to these anchor points here. Pretty sturdy anchor points and just secure that thing in case you have to smash on the uh, brake pedal uh, or if you are, are in a collision. So remember safety. So 
I'm going to put the case on top afterwards, but remember, safety. So one large, one medium. And then we take one small standing here. That's it. Little trick here. But maybe I can put it down instead. Will it fit? Will it fit? And now we can use will it fit guide. So suitcases. Yeah, I don't know how many. Suitcases. I make my own test. I do my own will it fit. It's crashing into something. Maybe it's the wheels. There we have it. So one large, one medium, one small. What are we going to do next? We're going to take the big one. See, the big one won't fit because we get in conflict with the door afterwards. But one large, one medium, one small. That's how it looks right now. And I will overlay all pictures I take because I have to be quick. So instead of the large, maybe we should have a medium to try. I think a medium would maybe work. I'm not sure, but we're going to take a small one. Yeah, we take a small one. We can probably have a small one next to it. No, but a small one. I'm not sure if I want to try this one. So we take a small this way, and then we take the soft handbag thing. All Samsonite. <laughs> I just love these cases. <laughs> so classy. Uh, so that, I think, is the end uh, results. I'm going to take one more before I need to put it back in again. And now, voila! Ba bam The EX30 can also have a roof box. Ski guard, once again, ski guard 830. Get it low and slung to the roof, the towing version. Yeah, pretty good. Just one case missing. But there we have one large, one medium, two small, and one little handbag thing. So, obviously, bigger car, bigger space. But I'm <laughs> surprised that the EX30 could chuck down so much suitcases. That is pretty good. Oh, what do you think? So, I think it's time to wrap up this video. Uh, maybe I will steal this and put it in my own car uh, before Thomas unnoticing, because I, I really like these cases. But, uh, probably I have to leave it here. So <laughs> I think I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you for watching and please drop a comment down below. What do you think? And I, pre I appreciate every like, every comment and if you will consider subscribing to my channel. So that's it for this time. I'll see you in the next one. Take care and bye bye.